Hey, what's up, guys? This is Your Power back again. So, today's video is all about calories in, calories out. So, in my previous video, as I told you about, you know, if you know you're maintaining calories, you know, it's just the law of thermodynamics. If you consume less calories than your body burns, you, you'll burn fat, or, and you know, if you consume more calories than your body burns, it's just like you know an equation kind of thing, the weighing scale. If you, if you eat whatever you cal you you know you're burning, so you will maintain weight. If you eat more than your body burns, okay, so you'll gain weight. And if you eat less than what your body you know burns, you'll or basically lose weight. So it's just like the law of th thermodynamics. So there are a lot of things involved, you know, uh, to calculate your maintenance calories. I've made a video. So do check it out to know your maintenance calories. So basically, if you eat above that, you will gain weight. If you eat below that, you will lose weight. But the video is not about, you know, it's just simple. But then, you know, it's not about calories in, calories out. Uh, basically, you know, if I tell you, you know, if my maintenance calorie is 2,000 calories, that doesn't mean I can have all the junk food in the world and I lose weight. No, it's totally different. Even all these foods have, you know, uh, macronutrients. They are really rich in nutrients. Like if you have a lot of vegetables, they are really uh, rich in photonutrients. If you have all these beef and meat and all that non-vegetarian non food, they have a lot of zoo nutrients. So they have a lot of you know good nutrition values in it. So if I tell you, you know, if your maintenance calories is two thousand, so you will be like, it's awesome. I can eat below that and I can lose. I mean, I can eat below that and I can lose weight. But no, yeah, you can lose weight, but you need to be eating healthy rather than you know just having sneakers and chocolates and everything so if, if you know you're maintaining the calories and if you want to lose weight basically just you know eat healthy food and just below your calories and that's it and one more question comes is what about if it fits your macros if it's really good you know you see people having all these good foods and burgers and chocolates and everything what about that uh, it's good but then again it comes down to 80 20 principle if you all know the Pareto principle so that's like a thing you know you can just, uh, I, I mean, I'll, I'll make a video about the Pareto principle later, but then you know, you can just have 20% of these junk foods and that's it. And on top of that, you know how social media is, how Instagram is, it's all hyped up, okay guys? People, if you see on Instagram, are totally different and when you meet them, they are totally different. Especially, you know, I've met a lot of friends and, you know, all these people on Instagram, they are like totally different and, you know, they're totally, <laughs> they look so awesome. They're like, they have the most happiest life, but then inside, you know, they're totally different. So don't get your things on, you know, don't see on Instagram like, oh my God, they're having all these junk food and still, you know, maintaining six packs and all that. I mean, whatever, they have a good body and all that. So no, that's not it. You need to have healthy foods and again it comes back to your calories in, calories out. You should know you're maintaining calories. So basically, if you eat below that, you lose weight. If you eat above that, you'll gain weight. And if you eat same amount of it, you'll maintain weight. But make sure to have good, healthy food. And this is my takes on calories in and calories out. Okay, awesome.